Hi guys, good morning. Happy Vlogmas Day 19. I am here at my mom's house, obviously. Well, not obviously, some of you probably don't know that. Oakland and I are upstairs in what, what used to be our bedroom and actually is going to be our bedroom again here soon. But I am dyeing my hair today. I'm so excited. I'm gonna be filming a whole video all about how I'm DIY balayaging my hair, but I wanted to vlog, I obviously have to vlog today too. I don't know when I'll post that video, if, it, if I'll wait till after Vlogmas or what, so I wanted to vlog, but I also am going to show how I'm doing it and all the products and all of like my tips and stuff. So I'm super excited. Oakland's just hanging out with me. And we're so excited to do it. Change of plans. I'm not doing my hair today. We just didn't have enough time. So I'll probably do it tonight when Riley gets home at my house. And I don't have any plans for the day now. Okay, I'm now wrapping presents for people in our family that are not me. And they're already in like boxes like this. So I don't know what they are anyways. But I'm helping my mom. She's doing some stockings. She gives us stockings like the night before. So we all open them at our leisure. Christmas morning and then we'll come over to her house. So she's working on all those out there. Oakland is napping, the dogs are just running around and I'm gonna wrap more. Um, I wish I'd asked for questions so I could answer questions while I wrap. So that it wasn't just like a montage voiceover but maybe it'll be really satisfying watching all the presents get wrapped. Who knows? I love doing the bows and the stickers. I didn't have any at my house, but I think I might take some home to wrap like our nieces and nephews yeah. presents with because I stinking love it. I just think it's so cute. I'm gonna take a break. I'm gonna go. I wrapped one present, I need a break. I'm going to get my phone and post on Instagram to see if there's any questions. I'm trying not to look at my house. There's any questions that I can answer while I'm wrapping, so. One sec. Okay, I have a cup, just a couple questions. Um, the first one was, any tips to, to, any tips on trying to conceive my husband and I just started talking, or. <laughs> trying. Now it's from Maggie Jo Wright. Um, honestly, I don't, the last video that I did that had a couple of tips on there was just like to stop stressing about it, which sucks because I hated when people told me that all the time, but that's like the only thing that I feel like worked for us was the month that I stopped stressing and caring and worrying so much about it is the month that I ended up being pregnant. That's all that I did. I just was stopped worrying about it. I was still taking prenatals and just I used the Glow Fertility app. Wow, I really undershot that. The Glow Fertility app and I feel like that helped a ton just so I knew kind of what was going on. But you do need to use that for a couple of months before it can be really accurate for you. So just plan in advance. 
but I'll have the video linked down below where I talk about all of our TTC just because that goes into way more into depth. And it has things that like my doctor told me to try and stuff like that because I'm obviously not an expert and I can't actually give any advice, but I can try. And wrapping presents is talking way harder than I expected. Especially a present that's literally this big. It's huge. I'll show you once it's wrapped. I really thought this would go better. Look how big it is. It's huge. <laughs> And then the next question was one of my favorite questions I've ever gotten from Taryn McGregor. And she said, can you tell us more about your mom? She seems to have a really fun life. And I love that because I think that about my mom too. And like people always comment when she's in the vlogs how much fun she is and how cute they think she is and stuff like that. So I thought it was so cute that someone asked a question about her. Um, so my mom is fantastic. She's French Canadian. She's wonderful and they're actually going on a five month world cruise they're literally going around the world for five months and they leave pretty soon actually and it's that's crazy to me because i'm not like that's so cool but so crazy i just i don't know anyone else who can do that so she's gonna come back very worldly and it's gonna be so much fun i'm really excited for her but also very sad that she's leaving me for five months but it's all okay. It'll all work out. <laughs> Just like wrapping this present will somehow work out. Luckily, this present's for Oakland. So the wrap job doesn't need to be perfect because this box is literally impossible to wrap completely. I know I could have used more paper and gone the other way, but I didn't want to. So I'm just using little strips to cover up where I didn't make it. Oh. Um, I don't really know what else to talk about about my mom. Mom, what are other fun facts about you? That I'm the youngest of five, and she had me when I when I <laughs> she had me when she was 27, and I'm the youngest of five kids. So she's phenomenal, basically, as a person who's had a kid now. Oh. I'm saying that's not going to happen for me. She can speak French, obviously, because she's French Canadian. Oh, she's a model, in case anyone was wondering. I literally get comments all the time how cute she is. Yeah, she's a model. That's why. Well, not why, but that doesn't explain it. I don't know what will. Um, she's a very successful businesswoman. She owns lots of businesses, runs and operates lots of businesses still, and I mean, just some cool stuff, right? But I, not that I take it, really, not that I take it for granted, but she's my mom, so I guess I don't, like every day I don't think about all the cool things that she does or has done. Until someone asks about her, then I'm like, oh yeah. She does this and this and this. Um, and I got a duplicate of that TTC question, but literally that's all the questions I got because I asked like five minutes ago. So that's all for now. <laughs> I wrapped as much as I could. Oakland's big present took a lot longer than I expected. Um, oh, you guys are so sweet. <laughs> I love messages from you guys. You guys are literally so sweet. Um, Oakland had a big blowout in my favorite pajamas of hers that she's wearing. <sighs> so I tried to hand wash those out. It's almost done. I'm just going to use a little bleach when I get home. They should be totally fine. My mom has to go to an appointment, so I wrapped as much as I could, but... I think that's all that I've got in me for right now. Um, and I need to go home. Hope I still really want to do my hair tonight. <sighs> if Riley, I don't know. I feel like it'll be hard because 
I totally like I feel like going to a salon is different obviously it totally is but like I've done my hair tons of times before and I know I'll cover it and everything but I feel like if she needs to feed I'm just a little hesitant about having her like on me while my hair is like up and has bleach in it I don't know it's kind of sketchy to me so I'm sure I'll figure it out I will always do what's best for her over my like vanity needs so I'm really not sure what to do but I might just wait until tomorrow again have my mom come to my house instead of me having to trek everything again and have her just like hang out and watch Oakland in the living room or in the bedroom and I'll do it in the bathroom so I don't know I need to leave um gather up my stuff and go I created such a mess but this is like the wrapping room so that's what it's for <laughs> anyways I'm gonna get her ready and we're gonna go home much later now it's like 6 45 oakland is eating and we're watching arthur claus i think arthur arthur christmas is what it's called on um freeform the app riley's sleeping they both just woke up from almost a two hour nap which was awesome except for it's 6 45 and the huckleberry app said she should probably take a nap around eight which it did last night and then she didn't go to bed till 11 30 which I don't know I like I trust the app so much because if I try to do it on my own she's like a horrible night's sleep and Riley keeps telling me go with your gut go with your gut but even if I try to put her down to sleep at like 9 she would stay awake until 11 like I don't know how the app is correct and it like I don't know it just says she should take a nap at 8 so I don't know if she's gonna or not I really am not quite sure tonight but we're all just kind of hanging out. Literally everybody besides me is asleep. Oakland's even falling back asleep while she's eating. Duke's asleep. Riley's asleep. And I don't think we're really going to do anything else. I'm going to do my hair tomorrow um, when my mom comes over to watch Oakland. So I don't know, that's probably all for tonight, but we'll see. We're going to Chick-fil-A, but it's pitch black outside. I'm not going to bring my camera because you're not going to see anything. So we're going to Chick-fil-A, and I'm super excited. 